Ah, right then, guys. It's time to take on the final boss of the Minish Cap. Let's rock. You are persistent, aren't you? So you've come to stop my little cere ceremony while well, you're too late. A mere three more chimes of the bell and will bring the ceremony to its end. With the third toll of the bell, I will, be I will become like a god. Your precious Princess Zelda will be nothing more than cold, dead stone. Not if we stop you, Foggy. Let's make sure our work wasn't for naught then, as low. Oh, crap. <laughs> I guess we are gonna have to fight some more Dark Nuts. Gotcha. You're not gonna stop me. I wouldn't have come this far. There you are, Vati! <laughs> Just a few more moments and the ceremony would have been complete. You really are obsessed with stop me, stopping me, aren't you? Very well. I have not yet drained all of the light force housed in Princess Zelda, but I would, but what I should have should suffice. I shall be transformed, unstoppable. Let me first attend to the pesky worms who would trifle with me. Uh-oh. I will have no more of you interfering with my plans. Let me show you true power. Bring it on! Alright, so first things first. We have to get rid of his little eyeball things first. Like that, do you, Vati? Oh, now they're covered in dark energy. We're gonna have to dispel the dark energy with the gust jar before we can dispel them.
We got him. First form down. <laughs> you seem to have some fight in you. I commend your bravery. But you will not survive this! <laughs> I am filled with a power that you cannot begin to understand. Do you think that puny sword will save you from me? Ah, uh, now you're starting to look like your classic body form there. Alright, so here we need to attack four of the eyeballs with arrows. Then we need to split up. And attack them all at once. Now we have to find the right ones. Because now the pattern changes. All right, and there goes the second form. What is this madness? I have the power of a god. I have unstoppable might. How could I lose to a child? Because you underestimated me. You underestimated me, Vadi. Yeah, let's go free Zelda from her petrification. I think it's been long enough. There you go, princess. You're finally flesh again. You're welcome, Zelda. Oh, excuse me a moment. Ooh, sorry about that interruption. I just had a call that I had to take real quick. Anyway, when I was turned to stone, I saw visions of you as if in a dream. Glad we saved her. Uh-oh. Oh, great. This seems familiar, escaping a crumbling castle. Right to the sanctuary. Let's go, Zelda. This is kind of like escaping the castle from Ocarina of Time at the end, only not nearly as intense. Uh oh. Vati, the master of this world? I think not. This is definitely what I remember Vati looking like. All right, so this is his. Tr this is truly his final form. What we need to do is wait. First, we need to wait. 
And once one of his arms pops up like that, we can flip it with the cane of Pachi. Then we need to quickly shrink ourselves and enter the arm. Take out the one that has one of these things that has an eyeball. Because that's the real one. Now we're gonna do the same thing for the other arm, we just need to wait. Good. Oh, it's dark in this one. There you are. Alright, that's both arms accounted for. Now it's just the main body. Split up. Ow. Alright, we need to wait for his special attack first. Or, or his spark attack. Timing right on that. The right angle. There we go. Definitely hurting. Definitely hurting now. The sparks are getting faster though. Oh, nice! That was cool. And we got him. You're done for, Vadi. Looks like all that power was good for nothing, huh? Man, that last volley there was really cool. I just pulled it off at the right moment. Hey, there's your magic cap, Ezlo. I was pretty brave, yes.
is low. Oh, good. The curse has finally been broken on him. The one Vadi placed on him that turned him into a hat. Eslo, Master of Minish Lore and Sorcery. The mage's cap was my creation, but its limitless power has caused nothing but trouble for your kind. Eh, yeah, don't worry about it. One with a just heart wears this cap, things can be made right again. Princess Zelda, let your wishes be made real. Alright, looks like the power of Zelda's light force and Ezlo's magic cap is restoring things to normal. by monsters. Hooray! Happy ending. Hey! Oh, so the hat broke after that. Hat has the power to turn the thoughts of its wearer into reality. Vati's heart was filled with evil, and, that's, and that was reflected in what he became. But it seems that Zelda's pure heart, coupled with the Hat's power, has created a miracle. You have to go now, huh, Ezlo? The Minish door opens but once every century, and soon it must close. I must leave you both now and return to my homeland. I know I've caused you much suffering, but the evil one's power has withered. The power of Zelda herself has restored the light to Hyrule. Link, my journey with you has been exciting to say the least. In fact, I'm more than just a little sad that we must part ways now. Hey, a new hat! Too bad this one can't talk. does suit you, little hero. Goodbye, Aslo. Farewell, my friend. Oh, there he goes. And with that, folks, that is the end of the Minish Cap. So overall, it's a it's a pretty decent Zelda game. It's also quite short, you know, considering it was on a handheld and all. But it's pretty decent. It's still not my favorite or anything, but it's still good. Definitely worth a playthrough. I just don't like the really randomized elements with, that comes with the Kinstone fusions and stuff. That's something I'm not a big fan of. At least they seem to do better with it this time. Anyway guys, um, there is going to be, I'm, I'm just going to go ahead and shut up and let the credits roll, but there is going to be one more video after this. I'll explain after the credits roll, so see you in a bit.
Thus did Link's quest come to an end. But surely this is not the end of Zelda and Link's adventures in Hyrule. The legend will continue. As long as the power of the Light Force echoes throughout the ages. So, that was the end. I guess we might as well save. Alright guys, so that was the end of Legend of Zelda Diminished Cap, but I am going to include one more bonus video. Um, I still have to show off all the figurines that I've been making off screen, and I think what I might do is I might beat the game one more time, just so that I can get the extra item that Biggeron can give you. Because you have to complete the game twice in order to get that. Alright, so I'm going to work on getting the last of the figurines, and I'll see you in the bonus video, guys. See you then.